Chuck Wagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games. Hey everyone, thanks for joining us for another great video here on Chuck Wagon MTG. Today we're going to be opening up a bunch of packs for the winners of various contests we've had fire off in the last week or two. Uh, the first one we're starting off with is going to be the contest that was started by MTG Strategist. Uh, he put out, uh, in kind of a celebration of the amount of followers and um, the page views that he had, which I believe were, he went excess of 40,000. Um, I could be wrong on that number, but I believe that's what it was. Um, he celebrated by creating a special devil-themed deck, uh, and then he gave it away. Um, and it wasn't, you know, some jank cheap card deck either. There were some, uh, there's Chandra's in there, a bunch of good land. There were Vexing Devils. I mean, there were good cards in there. So, um, anyways, he ran that contest, and uh, Tim Bister actually wound up winning that one with the most shares. Um, but we had such a positive response to it that he decided to do a second place prize, and then we threw in a third place prize, and then a fourth place prize. So we just kind of kept it rolling. So, um, Second place uh, went to Agent MLP412. Um, he had, I believe, over 600 shares in that particular contest. Uh, so he is taking that one. And then for the third and fourth place prize, we're actually going to do a random. Uh, we've got everyone's name in uh, the wheel to side, which you all know I love using. So we're going to go ahead and spin that, and we're going to pick our third and fourth place winners. Um, and then we're going to open up, uh, after that we've got a pack for the winner, uh, from the last video pack opening we did. We took all the comments, entered everybody in, and we're going to pick someone to give a random pack of Dominaria to. Um, I think that's it. I could be wrong. There might be more, but, uh, anyways, let's go ahead and, uh, we are going to bring up our Wheel Decide. Now, we're going to spin this two separate times, and the first person that comes up will be the uh, third place winner, and the uh, next person to come up will be the fourth place winner. Now, the third place winner, the prize is actually going to be fulfilled by another great MTG channel, Exotic MTG. They have a very special pack waiting for you, and they're going to do a video. They're going to open up and give it to you. Um, I wish I had those kind of packs to open up, but it's Morning Tide, and that's kind of awesome. Um, so anyways, without further ado, we're going to go to random.org. We're going to roll, roll ourselves two six-sided dice. We got nines. We're going to go ahead and click this wheel nine times, and then after that, whoever it selects, that person is going to be the winner of the pack supplied by Exotic MTG. So good luck to everybody. Once twice, thrice, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And the winner of that pack is going to be Kitchen Table Commander. You are the winner of that pack. Um, now we're going to roll this thing again, and this time it's going to be uh, uh, this will be the fourth place prize, which is uh, three packs of Dominaria that we're going to open up tonight for you. So we're going to do this again, roll some dice. We got seven. We're going to go ahead and click this seven times. Yeah, I better restart this. Um, and you know what? Uh, since Kitchen Table did take uh, the third place prize, we're going to go ahead and apply these changes. And so now... There we go. All right, and once again, we're going to randomize or spin this <laughs> this thing seven times. Good luck to everybody that's involved here. We got once, twice, thrice, four, five, six. I think it was six. No, it was seven. Whoops, one more time. Seven, and the winner of this is going to be Badgie. You are the winner of the three packs of Dominaria that we're going to open up for you right here right now but we've got one more we've got one more that we're gonna do uh we have our uh set from last week uh 
What did we open? Oh, we opened up prize packs. Okay. Or no, we opened up the box from uh, Was 3 MTG. That's what we did, which you should check them out, by the way. Good stuff there. Um, everyone that commented, your name got put in. We're going to do the same thing. We're going to go ahead and roll some dice. We got four, and we're going to go ahead and click this four times, and that person is going to win a pack of Dominaria. So we're just giving away packs left and right today. We got once, twice, thrice, and four times. Congratulations to Travi. Trav, you are the winner of the random pack of Dominaria. All right. Well, let's go ahead and start cracking these packs open. Um, the uh, the packs for, like I said, for second place, uh, that's Agent. Um, he's getting five packs uh, of Dominaria here. So... We're going to go ahead and we are going to start busting them open. Good luck to you, sir. Let's see what kind of good stuff we can get here. All right, and then you're going to get all the foils, the rares, mythics, all the good stuff out of it. All right, so we'll slow roll through this just in case we happen across uh, any of the rats because those are... Those are the ones that you know, people are kind of looking for right now. All right, all right, we got a Fire Fist Adept, nothing good. Void, a Four Bears Blade, and did we get a foil? We got a foil. You got a foil, the Flame of Keld. Oh, I'm not even centered. I'm sorry, buddy. And then we got a Baird Steward of Argive. So nothing really good there uh, out of those, but those, these two are good. In fact, this... This one right here in Limited is just, it is so ridiculously good. <laughs> so, already got a foil. That's always fun. And, you know, we really, we appreciate you guys watching, you guys commenting, all that good stuff. Um, kind of keeps us going. We really do. And the amount of particip participation we had in that contest was just absolutely awesome. All right, we got a Sarah Angel. We got a Spore Crown Thalid. Siege Gate Commander, that guy's not bad. And then you got, oh, nice. You got a Foil Mark Pool Island. I actually have someone that's looking for one of these right now. They just requested it today. Uh, and then we got a slime foot the stowaway. Tell you what, man, you are cooking with fire right now. That uh, that island is actually it's a nice little find there. Um, I got a feeling that's going to have a little bit of value here in the relatively near future. No rats. All right, we got in Bolas's clutches, Thorn Elemental, Goblin Chain Whirler. This guy just spiked. Good pull right there. And then we got a Raft Capuchin. Nothing really good right there. And then the non-foil version of that land. Tell you what, this these packs are good for you, man. These are some good stuff. I mean, nothing like a Karn or anything, but still, we got we got solid. This is solid. All right, we got any rats? No rats. All right, we got Wizard's Retort. Focus. There we go. Final parting, and... Oh, we got an Isolated Chapel and another Slime Foot. All right. Last pack for Agent. Wow, man, tell you, Agent got some solid packs here. Any rats? No rats, but we got another foil. Holy cats. All right, we got a fungal plot. Memorial to War. Territorial Allosaurus. And our foil is a Memorial to Glory. And then we got a Quendi. So, man, out of five packs, one, two, Three foils and two very solid rares. Um, CG and Commander, not so much. 
the Allosaurus, not so much. Um, the Blade, I, I really don't think it's worth a whole lot, but it's still a solid card. But these two right here, that that's that's solid right there. You you got good, sir. You got good. Uh, so those were Agent's cards. I'm going to put those in a sleeve so I don't lose them. I'm going to write his name on them. Because I still have packs up here that have not been claimed. I got a feeling Agent's going to claim his, though. I got a feeling. All right, so that's Agent's. Uh, next, we have... Uh, who do we got? Uh, oh, we got Badgie. Um, you got three packs. Now, this is from the MTG Strategist Contest. Uh, the same thing that uh, Agent just won. Uh, this is the, the fourth place prize. Same thing. All the foils, all the rares, all the good stuff. And any rats. Should we pull them? No rats. Dang it. All right. We got Wizards, Lightning, Sage of Latnam. Come on, focus. Uh, the Mending of Dominaria. Okay, and then we got a Tatiova Benthic Druid. That's actually, If you want that one, let me know, because that's actually not a bad card. Um, I mean, there's, there's no intrinsic value to it, but it's just, it is a solid card. Um, and if you ever plan on building uh, Merfolk EDH, right there, that's, that's kind of your thing. Um, or even Brawl. Ooh. Merfolk Brawl. Anywho. Uh, we're looking for rats. We got any rats. Come on, rats. No rats. Okay, we got a Memorial to Folly, if I can stay in camera. We got a Sanctum Spirit, and we got a Yogmoth's Vile Offering. And Yargle, the glutton of Urborg, uh, who is proving to be less than impressive. But I still like the name, so dang it, he's good. Um, okay, last pack here. This is for Badgie, which, by the way, if you don't, if you don't watch Badgie, um, <laughs> that is an interesting twist on MTG videos. That fuzzy little guy makes my day. He really does. Uh, okay, we're looking for... Not a single rat. Alright, we got the wall. Memorial to War, and... Oh, the Antiquities War. Sad face. Uh, and then a Slinvada, the Rising Deep. Okay, well... Um, we'll go ahead... I'll, I'll send... Like I said, I'll include this one, because this is actually not a bad card. Uh, I will go ahead and send that to you. We're going to go ahead and... Put those in. Write a name... And there are your cards. Good, sir. Okay, and then, now we're opening a pack for Travi Trav, right here. Uh, you are the one who won from the comments in the last video where we opened stuff up. And, uh, you know, I'm going to go ahead and flag that for the next contest. Uh, go ahead and comment on this, and probably the next time we open packs, we'll go ahead and open up a pack of, probably going to be Dominaria, uh, but one of y'all win that, so... All right, come on, rats. <sighs> Stinking rats. All right, we got a Skizik. Merfolk Trickster. And... Oh, the Flame of Keld. That means we got a Legendary, is it? No, it's not. I'm sorry. But it is an Ariel, Knight of the Windgrace. So that, that's not entirely bad. That uh, That's kind of good stuff right there. All right, so those are your cards I can go ahead and... Now, once again, all of you, you have to contact me to claim your prize. Because if I don't know where to send these cards, I can't send them. So please, for all that is holy, get a hold of me. Send me contact information. Or you know what? Get a hold of me and tell me to piss off you don't want the cards. Whatever, just get a hold of me. Uh, however you want to do it. Uh, so, Trav, these are yours... If I can spell your name, which shouldn't be that hard because it's only four letters. Um, and then we're going to do one more pack here. Now this is for, we have our uh, our patron build a pack box. 
um, which if you don't know what that is, check out our Patreon page. We'll get a link down below in the description. Um, if we happen to get something good, it's going to go in that box. If we don't get anything good, it's not going to go in there because we only want good stuff going in there. Um, like maybe a rats. Is there a rats? you be kidding me. All right, well, we got a cast down. That can go in there. Uh, final parting, not really. Virgent Force, uh, I don't think so. Uh, but we did get a, uh, a Chronicler. So, and Arvad the Cursed, I, geez, I don't think he's worth anything. I'll double check. Um, well, we at least got a cast down and a foil to put in there. Um, and the cast down, we'll go ahead and throw that uh, in the un uncommon slot, because well, it's an uncommon. And like I said, I don't think Verdant Force is... Uh, I could be wrong. You know, for some reason, Sapperlings are kind of doing crazy things right now, so I could be wrong on that. But uh, I'll double-check. If it's worth something, I'll throw it in. If it's not... Um, now, be sure... Oh, I just bumped the camera. Um, be sure to check out... Uh, we're going to be opening up some Battle Bond here next week, and we're going to have some of that going in to our Build-A-Pack box as well. Um, and be sure to check out those Patreon videos. We're going to start putting those up in the next, I believe, week and a half week, week and a half, we're going to start having those videos up of this month's patrons. Um, I know we've got at least one uh, Battle Bond uh, box being opened up for a patron, plus we're going to be doing some other stuff. It's going to be all sorts of fun. Um, also, don't forget, we are starting to stream on Twitch. Um, we're not doing a whole lot of it. Uh, well, actually, we're doing somewhat regularly. Um, we don't have a big audience, so essentially we're just playing Magic Arena um, or Magic Gathering Online. We kind of let people choose whoever's watching. Uh, in fact, I'm probably going to go do some of that right now while this stuff is rendering. So anyways, thank you very much for watching. If you like what you saw here today, do us a huge favor. Click that like button. Hit subscribe. Be sure to share this with your friends, your family, your loved ones, and your pets. Everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Once again, thank you very much for watching, and as always, you can find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch, Chuckwagon MTG. Now, if you could do me one last favor and check out this brief message about our sponsor. Chuckwagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games, now at one mega location to fill all of your gaming and comic needs. They have Magic the Gathering events every night of the week, as well as Warhammer, Pathfinder, Dungeons and Dragons Adventures League, Final Fantasy TCG, Pokemon, and Star Wars X-Wing events all throughout the week. They also have close to 100,000 comics on site. This is why I have personally made BC Comics and Games my home gaming store.